This was a playoff type game. Back and forth they went, these two clubs. 22 lead changes, or actually 22 ties, 18 lead changes. Nuggets in the final analysis make some big plays down the stretch and they ride the young guy just shy of 21 years of age, Jamal Murray, to a career high 38 points and a, an extraordinary shooting performance. 14 of 19 from the field, four of six from three, six of six from the line for Murray who also managed to dole out six assists. And it was a tough one to sustain here tonight, Lamar, because the Blazers defensively played so well. They had 11 steals, six blocks, forced 15 turnovers, scored 22 off the turnovers. Yeah, that first half was one of the Blazers' best defensive performances for any half of the entire season. And we're talking about a team that has been within the top 10 defensive rating pretty much all season long, a lot of that time in the top five. So it really speaks volumes to how locked in they were defensively, how aggressive the steals, the deflection, the block shot, the contest at the rim, it was all there and it was leading up to what we saw, a, a, a finish at the end where it almost seemed like maybe whoever had the ball last or close to last would have a chance to win the game. Jamal Murray, he was incredible. I mean, the guy pours in 38 points, a lot of tough threes, tough shots. And, uh, he showed you why Blazers assistant coach David Vanterpool compared him to Damian Lillard in terms of his scoring ability, his ability to turn it on in, in, a, in the blink of an eye, really. And so it's one of those tough games because Damian Lillard, once again, poured in his 25 points, his eight assists. I thought Ed Davis was phenomenal on the glass, as was Zach Collins. They provided good minutes. Yusuf Nurkic, after a bit of a slow first half, really kicked it in the gear in the second half, got some rebounds, uh, some, some and ones, just really aggressive around the basket, but just not enough uh, at the end with Jamal Murray and the and one he gets to put him up over the top. Blazers get a chance last second. They throw a length of the court pass. And, never able to control the basketball and the Nuggets went away with the win. Nurkic 19 points 12 rebounds and his return to Pepsi Center for the first time since the trade to play against his ex-teammates. He also had three blocks in 26 minutes of work. So the Blazers with a loss go to 25 and 22 on the year and on the road they are even now at 12 and 12. Denver uh, in a, a real quasi must win situation here. They take this series lead now two games to one one game remaining but it catapults Denver back into the talk of a playoff. They were coming in even at 23 23 and were ninth best in the West. Denver wins this one at home 104 to 101.